hard to pick one emotion because it's so uplifting to have them back. Dozens of families have been reunited tonight. Even a new dad is connected with a newborn he's never met. Yeah, the USS Hartford returned to his home port in Groton. Channel 3 New London Bureau Chief Kevin Hogan has the heartfelt reunion. As the long air horn blasts its welcome home signal, families of the USS Hartford anxiously waited for the sub to tie up to the pier. The Learn family flew in this morning from California. What's it like for families uh, being displaced for so much time? It's, it's very difficult. They miss everything. But it's great, fantastic. You know, we're here to support them. And we got our family with us. Handmade signs were everywhere. Life takes you around the world. Love brings you home. And my favorite, every girl needs her anchor. Mine comes home today. I'm nervous, but so excited. It was a long six months, so I'm excited for him to be home and for our life to start together. Amber Cool and her family had a very emotional first hug for her sailor, communications tech Jason Cool. It's so uplifting to have them back like it's been such a long six months that's amazing <laughs> it's been a long time coming as for lieutenant ben hankin this new dad finally gets to see his baby born just 16 days ago grateful and appreciative and happy he's back the traditional first kiss for chief electrician's mate brandon garver was sweet don't know though about the full speed ramming hug from his kids the pier was filled with emotion everywhere you turned tears of joy as the six long months of separation melted away. It was a tough six months. It's always tough saying goodbye to the families. But now that we are together again, <laughs> totally different story now. Thank you. As you imagine, all the families will be celebrating tonight. It's a great homecoming. With the Mobile Newsroom in Groton, Kevin Hogan, Channel 3, Eyewitness News.